Hey guys, it's Jay Hart and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Major keys, I'm the boss. Don't go Zelda go off. Left from the law and If you guys are new here and this is your first time watching the video, please hit that subscribe button. After you hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that like button because you will like this video. You will really like it. And after you hit that like button, please hit that notification button, bell thing to make sure you guys are notified for future uploads. I will be making a video on this look and that video will be uploaded after this one so i record mondays wednesdays and fridays if you guys need to know um this video my makeup video is going up wednesday i don't know what i'm going to film for friday yet so i'll leave that for the future but this video is going up monday so yeah thank you guys for watching and make sure you guys get into this video you guys like my case look at that sailor moon i love sailor moon okay the first thing this is going off the top of my head because it's taking forever to load up so the first thing i'm not gonna buy is the kim kardashian um contour sticks if you guys seen those if you guys seen People, like it's a whole bunch of controversy on those products and her products in general so I'm not gonna be buying those because first of all I really don't use sticks like that like to contour and highlight and stuff I just use my I just use a bronzer so so I'm not gonna be purchasing it purchasing ugh, purchasing it because Plus you only get like you don't get that much product so I would not buy something like that or spend that much money on something with little minuscule minuscule product. The second thing I'm not gonna buy is the Kat Von D Shade and Light 2 palette. The glitter basically the glimmer sheen side of the Shade and Light one. Not gonna buy that because I don't know it's some brown, some neutral, some a black, like they're all shimmers. I don't really like wearing shimmers like that, so I probably would not buy it. No offense towards Kat Von D or anything. I don't really like it like that and my neighbors keep walking over my head like. Yes, bitch, yes. Like I see the separation on my neck. Like if y'all just start like avert your eyes to my neck. You can see the separation. That is one reason why I set my neck with translucent powder is because of that reason. That's how it would look. So do not clock me. We you sit your ass down, bitch. Like sit the fuck down, okay? Sit down. So yeah, the swatches look pretty nice. The swatches like really do look pretty nice. Um, but I'm not gonna purchase it. So swatches look amazing. Still not gonna purchase it. <laughs> The third thing I'm not going to purchase this summer is the Sephora collection of their new eyeshadow palettes. Here go my neighbors again, y'all. Like, I would mute this and, like, just clip it out and just skip it. But I just want y'all to, he like, hear what I have to deal with when I'm recording. Like, are y'all serious? Like, bitch, sit the fuck down. Can y'all, can y'all sit down for at least 15 to 20 minutes? Like, can y'all do that? No, y'all can't. I guess. They're Sephora's new eyeshadow palettes. I'm not going to purchase those because just look at them. Like, like one's like a colorful palette. Don't need that. Especially not for that price. <laughs> Bitch. Especially not for that price, okay? Don't need that. Um, their warm palette, too. Do not need that because those I have two shadows, like I told y'all before. I have the 35O and the 35B. Those are basically just glorified and overpriced 35O and 35B palette. It's not that, like... It's not like I'm trying to butcher Sephora or their collections, because I know some people that work at Sephora, and they say their products are pretty good. But I would not buy it because... I feel like they're just too overpriced and some beauty influencers have purchased them already but I just feel like they're just they're too overpriced like for something for those things like I don't really care about those palettes because I those are the palettes are just pointless like they're very pointless I would not purchase those I'm sorry the other thing I'm not gonna buy is the 
Um, Violet Voss ex Na Nicole Nicole Concilio Palette. <laughs> I butchered her name. I butchered your name, girl. I'm sorry, but <sighs> what is with these pointless palettes? Like people always like people have done these palettes over and over again, and they just think that they're just something new. When I have palettes with all those shades in it y'all do not buy this shit like like what the fuck like i get what you i get what like i'm happy for some beauty influencers that collab with brands and you know they actually take pride into their they actually take pride into their work that they do with that brand or what they did but Y'all, come up with something new. Like, it, it's pointless. Come up with something new. Come up with something new. L listen here. L listen, listen, sis. Listen, listen. Come, come here, come here. Come, come up with something new. Okay, come up with something new, something that's not, that haven't been done before. Come up with something new. Yeah, just come up with something new. Like, I would be so happy if some brands would just come up with something new. Like, like what the, f like, I don't know what's going through their heads. I don't know. They need to come up with something new for real. What? Another thing I'm not gonna do, I mean, not gonna buy is the Sahara 2 palette by Juvia's Place. The palette hasn't even came out with the colors yet, but first of all, let me screenshot this. I'm not gonna buy it because, because I feel like Juvia's Place is, I feel like somehow they're affiliated with Morphe. Somehow, somehow they're affiliated with Morphe and I would not buy the none of Juvia's places eyeshadow palettes. Now, if they sent me something, then I'm pretty sure they're not gonna send me anything after this video. But if they sent me something, like I would, I mean, I would try it to see how it is. But I wouldn't. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't like it. I don't know. <sighs> Here we go. People doing pointless shit again, y'all. <laughs> like, are you? <sighs> A Snow White collection with Disney and Bessemi Cosmetics. Um, this is pointless. <laughs> who would buy? Who would buy? Uh. Disney themed, Disney themed makeup. Can y'all answer that question? Can y'all just leave like a little comment down there? Tell me if you would buy it. I mean, I'm, I don't get upset about other people's opinions because their opinions. I wouldn't buy it, but if you would buy a let me screenshot this so yeah, I can have pictures for y'all. If you will buy any one of these items, leave that down below, please. Thank you. So, yeah. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And after you hit thumbs up, make sure you go hit that subscribe button. After you hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that bell button to make sure you guys are notified for every time I upload because I'm back on the road. <laughs> so as you can see, I promise you guys I did a look today. I did the look today. And if you guys want to see that video, the video will be up. So make sure you hit that not notification button. I think that's what it's called. Notification button to make sure you guys are, you know, to make sure you guys get it and make sure you, you know, because some, some people do really like my makeup videos, some of them, not too many people, but 
Yeah. And what was the other thing? I think I'm gonna redo the intro. The intro is, yeah. Bye guys.